Hey guys, Preston Bill, Comic Book University and Eugenics, issue number one of three from Boom Studios. Okay, this is one of those creepy, crazy, crawly, freaky comics <laughs> that are just going to completely change your world, man. Like, this is wicked. Check this out. James Tinney the Fourth and Eric Donovan, these two knuckleheads, decided to make a comic book about this dude who... It's funny because I had a feeling something like this was going to happen. He... Basically, in the year 2022, I think it was, he creates this, um, or excuse me, the, this, it starts with like a patient zero down in Mississippi and all of a sudden this crimson death virus thing goes out and starts killing people by the millions. Well, what is this now? Like 13 years later, I think it was something like that. This one doctor comes up with a cure. All right. Like at least two years in the making, possibly more, but two years with some good results. And he finally comes up with a perfect cure, dispenses it. More than half the people in the world currently have it right now. Well, some of these uh, people are having babies now, and these babies are being born really mutated, like ugly mutated. And they're all like, you know, what's going on? It's coming from the, the thing. All right, here's the deal. In some ways, this is a way to try and make people afraid of vaccinations, at the same time, <laughs> there's also a bunch of people who were killing others who had this sickness, this prior to this particular uh, disease cure, this, excuse me, this uh, vaccination going out. So the, the people were getting this, this disease that was killing everybody they needed the vaccination for, and they were killing these people. They were hanging them up, stringing them up, and like murder parties were started to take these people out. Like it was ridiculous. Plus, this guy also remembers 9-11 uh, and, you know, his mother, what she was talking about with it and just all these different viewpoints. So this guy decided, you know what, I'm not just going to cure this disease, but I'm going to cure the disease of the human heart. If we all look similar or alike, then there's no more racism. Uh, this is really weird. <laughs> this is a really weird way to do it. I've always made the joke myself that racism will end once the green aliens come down from space and start attacking us, you know? It's obviously a joke, but it's like, you know, all we need is some common denominator for us to all back behind to put aside our differences and then we're good, right? So I've always been waiting for the green aliens to come and try to exterminate us. <laughs> Joking. Anyway, um, this is a radically different approach <laughs> instead of green aliens. This is just making us into aliens. There's still two more books in this double-sized issue to come out, and I am anxiously looking forward to it. Uh, Tinny the Fourth has shown his chops uh, in the Detective Comics books. Um, nothing but good impressions coming out of that, and boom. This guy's got a great imagination. Really great imagination. And I'm giving this comic right now an A. This was good. It was so weird. So many things are going to happen in this comic book. You're like, whoa, why did that happen? And all of a sudden later on, oh, yeah, that's messed up. <laughs> that's messed up. This was really good. I'm going to recommend this. I'm very glad myself that I picked this up completely on a whim. I saw an issue one from somebody else. I'm like, yeah, I'll check it out. Anyway, guys, Professor Bell Comic Book University. Class dismissed.